it was a wonderful opportunity for me to work once again at Abbey Road Studios. I've been so lucky for 20 odd years to have lived 20 minutes from Abbey Road Studios. Uh, Studio One is huge, it's like an aircraft hangar, it's got a really high ceiling, uh, a lot of your kind of Spielberg movies and uh, you know the John Williams, Star Wars, um, you know the James Bond movies, they probably would have been recorded in there. Uh, because of this high ceiling of course you can get a lot of distance from large groups of players and that helps with that epic sound. Uh, with Weatherwalker I was able to use a large string group in Studio One and a smaller group, slightly more intimate sound in Studio Three. And so there's a pictorial equivalent if you like. When you're somewhere very spectacular you've got the big panoramic vista which uh, represents the music that you can hear from Studio One but then you've got all of your mid-ground, all of that wonderful changing light and beautiful kind of uh, poetic scenery you pass as you walk uh, that could be represented by the musicians that are closer to you, you know, the, the, the group of the eight strings and then of course on top of that we've got our improvising soloists as well so yeah it is truly kind of cinematic in the sense that I've uh, imitated a lot of kind of pictorial experiences.